pro tip. If you're flying your drone in Florida, you gotta have this stuff. <laughs> Can you really give a pro tip if you're a rookie though? Today I'm going to demonstrate the uh, Find My Drone feature of the DJI Fly app for the Mini 2. I've never used this feature before. Um, I'm hoping that it's as easy as everybody says it is on the videos that I've watched. But you just never know. So I'm actually heading to a soccer field right now, uh, so we'll be in a wide open space. Because honestly, if it's not... If it doesn't work like it's supposed to, I still want to be able to find Jack, you know? Alright guys, here we go. Getting all set up to do this test. Take off. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Do my normal, uh, my normal test where I go up and down, go left and right. Whoops, wrong left. <laughs> left, right, and then forward and backwards. This just makes me a little more comfortable to know that the drone is doing what it's supposed to do. So what I did was I went over to the baseball field and I put down a, a landing pad. So let's go find that landing pad. Let's get this simulation off and running. The home point has been updated. Please check it on the map. Home point's been updated. There we go. We're all set. We got 22 satellites. Got a strong signal. Got good battery for now. I'm going to raise up to about 100 feet. And I'm going to start flying towards that landing pad. It's over there by second base somewhere. <laughs> Whoop, I'm a little high. Let me pull the gimbal down so I can see where I'm at exactly. Pull the gimbal down and find that landing pad. There we go, there it is. So there's the landing pad between home or between second base and the pitcher's mound. And I'm gonna try to land right on top of it. Okay. All right, so I'm gonna come down. I can still see the drone, of course. I'm only 387 feet away. I got a perfect view of the drone landing on the, uh, I'm able to see that actually in the screen. I'm going to get right over that pad. <laughs> it's not as easy as you think. <laughs> All right, that should be good. Let me go back a little bit. <laughs> I've never landed on this pad before either, so this is a day of firsts. This should be good here, hopefully. Landing. Oh, he might have landed right off the pad. Oh, looks like he got on the pad. Okay, so scenario begins. Uh-oh, it, it had to land on me because the battery was low. So what you do is, is apparently you pull the map up. This is a map of the flight. So Jack is the triangle. I am the blue dot. And... The red line is the straightest, or as the drone flies between us. So if I start walking along that red line, I should be able to find Jack in no time. It's only 387 feet away. So let's get walking, get some steps in while we're at it. But so far it's pretty simple, pretty simple to understand. I'm gonna have to uh, veer off the path of the red line though, um, in order to get into that baseball field. 
reason that you see two uh, flight path lines is because I flew a flight path over there earlier just to make sure that I could see the, the pad. But it's tracking me really well. I guess it's tracking the controller and it's tracking uh, Jack. He's, of course, just sitting there. There's a lady over there with her dog, too. Hopefully she doesn't find that drone over there. <laughs> Alright, so I'm just walking through the dugout here. Okay, so I see Jack now. He's on the landing pad. I'm walking towards him. But let's say that you can't, you can't find him. So what you're supposed to do is... You're supposed to hit the find my drone button and it pulls it up on the map you can zoom in you can say oh wow i'm really close but you still can't find them so you hit the start flashing and beeping button and i don't know if you can hear it or not but i can hear jack beeping it's not very loud i was kind of expecting it to be louder than that but there he is so, what do y'all think? Well, I gotta say, that's one of the easiest features of the app to use uh, since I started messing around with things. Um, it's a good thing that it's easy to use because imagine the stress that you'll be under when this does happen to you, when you have a, a forced landing and you've gotta go out there into the field and find your drone. So, good job DJI. It's a great app, it's a great feature. Um, I'm very, very pleased with uh, the outcome for today. And uh, I want to thank Jack. He's the star of the show. And uh, God bless you guys.